The abacus is an ancient counting tool made using beads and rods to aid in fast calculations. It is still considered one of the fastest and most effective ways of doing error-free calculations. It is used to perform all the basic calculations such as addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, square roots, and cubic roots. The abacus consists of columns of beads which represent the place value of a number. Different combinations of beads represent different numbers, even up to the billionth place. Let us learn more about abacus. The abacus is made of an open wooden or plastic frame consisting of beads mounted on sticks or rods called columns that represents place values. Depending on the design, it contains either 13 or 17 rods. Each rod has five beads in total. There are five dots in the abacus. The middle dot represents the ones or units place and increases in value by tens place towards the left. The columns towards the right of the middle dot represent decimal values. The frame is divided into two rows by a bar called reckoning bar. The beads in the top row are called upper beads or heavenly beads. The beads in bottom row are called lower beads or earthly beads. The top row has one bead in each column. It has a value of 5 in the middle dot. The columns on the left of the middle dot represent the 50s, 500s, and so on. The bottom row contains four beads. It has a value of 1 in the middle dot. The columns towards left represent values of 10s, 100s, 1000s, and so on. The beads are counted by moving them upward and downward towards the bar. The bead is counted if it touches the bar. If no bead is touching the bar, that column is considered equal to zero. For example, to display the number 121 using abacus, one bead is moved towards the bar on the units column, two beads in the tens column and one bead in the hundreds column. Learning abacus to perform calculations brings great academic benefits. The children start visualizing the abacus beads for each number in the mind to do the calculations very quickly. Generally, numbers are very abstract and difficult to remember. Using abacus, we give an image to the numbers, and children start performing mind math, even without the device.